Hey, what's up YouTube? This is Watch Junkie. Today I'm going to do a tutorial on how to remove markings on the Skimi 1335. For this video, we're going to use this Skimi 1335 in gold version. Yeah, we're going to do a removal of the markings of this Illuminous, L Luminous and Dual Time. Okay, and uh, just a quick wrist check. I am also using my Casio AE1200. Also, um, a quick update on what I did on the Skimmy I have uh, reviewed on my previous video. So this is how it looked like without the markings. I remove all the markings, even the inner frame, which has branding there and also the functions. Yeah, I believe less is more. So yeah, um, this is the old skimmy now on this video um i'm just going to do a tutorial how to remove this and what uh, things that you will be needing okay so let's just put this uh, black skimmy aside what you need is only uh, three basic things okay now the first one is a cotton bud a clean cloth wd-40 i already have poured that in a bottle cap Let's get down to it. First, you're going to wet the tip of the bud. Okay. What you need to do is you're going to rub the surface. Okay. So you just have to rub it gently. Okay. Um, you don't want to put a lot of pressure in it. You, you know, just rub it gently. Okay. As you can see there. Um, let's just try on this one. Okay. As you can see already that the markings are already slowly coming off it's quite a long process but yeah uh, I'm gonna pause the video and we're gonna check once this process is already done okay almost an hour of fiddling on the um, the watch well the result is um, it's not as great as I hope it would be and it's not as easy anyways there you go okay so it looks like i kind of messed up on the center as you can see there uh, there's a scratch i really don't know probably a dust you know uh, got caught up on the cotton buds i'm using but on the top as you can see it's quite uh, okay so there you go um the specs is actually it's the same it's the exact same model of uh, uh, this black one so i'm just gonna link a description of the review of this one that i did in um, couple of videos back there you go so this is how it looks like not the best one as you can see there see uh, you can notice uh, you know on the sides but on the top pretty okay um, quite clean I suppose okay um, well yeah okay for the price point of this uh, watch that I cannot really complain a lot I don't feel sorry you know on, on uh, doing this in fact you know I, I I bought this for the sake of this video just so you know this is not a sponsored video every watch that I show in this video is basically acquired by me all right so uh, there you go um, probably I'm just going to continue on removing the markings on the inner frame yeah it's going to be uh, a tedious work I apologize you know I, I cannot uh, show that in the video because I'm going to remove all the screws and take all the module out and take the frame inside and yeah, from there on I'm gonna work on it and yeah so yeah there you go um, well again you know if you learn something about this video I strongly suggest you know don't do it it's just gonna ruin the paint job this is just an experiment it didn't turn out great as great as this one yeah that's about it for this video so until then this is uh, watch junkie saying keep watching bye